How chronic kidney disease affects the body. Chronic kidney disease is a complex condition that profoundly impacts the body, extending well beyond impaired kidney function. While it primarily affects the kidneys, it also wreaks havoc on various organs and systems, leading to a cascade of complications. One of the most notable and life-threatening consequences of CKD is its profound impact on cardiovascular health, increasing the risk of heart disease and stroke. However, CKD's detrimental effects are not confined to the cardiovascular system. It also influences bone health, metabolism, and immune function. In this video, we're going to explore the multifaceted ways in which CKD can affect the body with a focus on cardiovascular complications and other organ-related issues. You might be wondering about who I am and why I'm qualified to talk about this. If you're someone living with chronic kidney disease, I've got great news for you. Hello, I'm Athea Ford, a registered dietitian nutritionist specializing in chronic kidney disease and owner of renaldiethq.com. I specialize in helping people just like you improve their health by making simple yet delicious changes to your meals. Together, we can transform your eating habits, boost your overall well being, and ensure that you're enjoying every bite along the way. Say goodbye to bland and boring meals and say hello to a healthier, more vibrant life. Let's get started on this incredible journey to better health together. Visit renaldiethq.com today and take the first steps towards a healthier lifestyle. All right, let's jump into it. Cardiovascular complications are among the most significant and life-threatening consequences of CKD. As kidney function declines, the risk of heart-related problems substantially increases. CKD affects the cardiovascular system through various mechanisms. CKD leads to the accumulation of waste products and excess fluid in the body causing hypertension or high blood pressure, a major risk factor for heart disease. CKD disrupts mineral and electrolyte balance, such as calcium and phosphorus, which can contribute to vascular calcification, hardening of arteries, and increasing the risk of heart attacks and strokes. CKD leads to inflammation, oxidative stress, and endothelial dysfunction, further promoting cardiovascular issues. Managing cardiovascular complications in CKD involves strict blood pressure control, lipid management, or you know blood cholesterol levels, and lifestyle modifications. Medications and dialysis eventually might be necessary. Recognizing the close link between CKD and cardiovascular health is crucial in preventing heart-related complications and improving the overall quality of life for CKD patients. Now let's talk about the effects on other organs. CKD is a systemic condition that can have far-reaching effects beyond cardiovascular complications. Several other complications can arise as kidney function declines. Anemia. CKD often leads to reduced production of red blood cells, causing anemia. Anemia can result in fatigue, weakness, and cognitive impairment. Bone health issues. CKD affects mineral metabolism, leading to imbalances in calcium and phosphorus. This can cause bone disorders like renal osteodystrophy, increasing the risk of fractures. Fluid and electrolyte imbalances. CKD can disrupt the balance of fluids and electrolytes in the body, leading to conditions like edema or fluid retention, electrolyte imbalances, and muscle cramps. Neurological complications. CKD can lead to neuropathy, cognitive impairment, and even seizures in severe cases. Gastrointestinal problems. Uremic toxins can affect the digestive system, leading to symptoms like nausea, vomiting, and a loss of appetite. Immune system weakness. CKD can impair the immune system's function, making patients more susceptible to infections. Managing CKD involves addressing these complications through a combination of medications, dietary modifications, and in later stages, renal replacement therapy like dialysis or kidney transplant. Regular monitoring and early intervention are crucial in minimizing the impact of these complications on patients' quality of life. Complications of kidney failure. End-stage renal disease, or ESRD, or renal failure, is the most advanced stage of CKD, and it carries several profound complications and implications for affected individuals. One of the most significant implications is the necessity for renal replacement therapy, primarily dialysis or kidney transplant as the kidneys have lost their ability to function adequately at all. ESRD patients often require frequent and time-consuming dialysis treatments, typically multiple sessions per week. These treatments can disrupt their daily lives, making it challenging to maintain regular employment or engage in 
usual activities. The dietary restrictions and fluid limitations imposed to manage the condition can affect your quality of life. Cardiovascular complications are prevalent in ESRD as individuals are at a higher risk of heart disease, hypertension, high blood pressure, and strokes due to fluid imbalances, electrolyte abnormalities, and the accumulation of waste products in the bloodstream. In fact, cardiovascular events, heart attacks, strokes, are the leading cause of death in people with kidney disease. Severe anemia is common among ESRD patients, leading to fatigue and reduced overall well-being. Many require regular injections of erythropoietin to manage this condition. ESRD can also affect bone health, potentially causing bone pain and an increased risk of fractures. Mental health concerns such as depression and anxiety often accompany the diagnosis due to the emotional and psychological challenges associated with the disease, including the burden of regular treatments. For many individuals with ESRD, kidney transplantation offers a better quality of life compared to long-term dialysis. However, access to suitable donor organs can be limited and transplant recipients must commit to lifelong immunosuppressive medications to prevent organ rejection. The financial and social impact of ESRD is substantial, affecting not only patients, but also their families. The cost of ongoing treatments, medications, and potential lifestyle adjustments can be a significant burden. Preventing CKD is a paramount goal in healthcare, given its significant impact on individuals' well-being and the healthcare system. This section digs into proactive measures to prevent CKD, focusing on identifying risk factors, adopting a healthy lifestyle, and emphasizing the importance of routine checkups. By understanding and managing risk factors such as high blood pressure, diabetes, and obesity, individuals can take proactive steps to reduce their vulnerability to CKD. Lifestyle choices, including maintaining a balanced diet, staying physically active, and avoiding harmful substances, play a pivotal role in kidney health. Regular medical checkups are crucial for early detection and intervention, enabling healthcare providers to address potential issues promptly and optimize kidney health. I would also mention that it's important for you to look at your lab results every time your doctor does them, get a copy, check what your EGFR is on the paper to see where you're at in the process. Because many times doctors I've been told do not mention this to patients that they're in stage three. And if you want to know and start taking proactive action, you need to be reading your lab results. Identifying risk factors for CKD is vital for early prevention and intervention. Common risk factors include hypertension, diabetes, a family history of kidney disease, and a history of recurrent kidney infections. By recognizing these factors, individuals can take proactive steps to minimize your risk. High blood pressure and diabetes are two major contributors to CKD. Managing blood pressure through lifestyle changes and medications, as well as controlling blood sugar levels, can significantly reduce the risk of kidney damage. Additionally, being aware of family history prompts increased vigilance and regular screenings. A history of kidney infections underscores the importance of promptly treating urinary tract infections to prevent kidney damage. Other risk factors such as obesity and smoking can also impact kidney health. Routine checkups with healthcare providers can help assess or monitor these risk factors. Early detection and management are key to preventing or slowing the progression of CKD, preserving kidney function, and enhancing overall health. Maintaining a healthy lifestyle plays a pivotal role in preventing CKD. It starts with identifying and addressing potential risk factors, understanding your personal risk, whether it's due to diabetes, high blood pressure, family history of kidney disease, or other factors like PKD empowers you to take proactive measures. A key aspect of prevention is adopting a kidney-friendly diet. This includes reducing sodium intake, limiting processed and higher sugar foods, and monitoring phosphorus and potassium levels, as well as reducing your protein intake, especially if you have underlying kidney risk factors. Staying adequately hydrated without overloading on fluids is equally important. Controlling blood pressure and blood sugar levels is crucial. Regular monitoring, medication adherence, and lifestyle adjustments can help manage these risk factors effectively. Incorporating physical activity into your routine not only aids in weight management, but also contributes to overall health. Avoiding smoking and excessive alcohol consumption can protect kidney function. Being mindful of over-the-counter medications, especially non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs or NSAIDs like ibuprofen, 
and consulting a healthcare provider before their regular use is essential. I'll put a link in the description below for more information on alcohol consumption with kidney disease. Regular checkups are a cornerstone of chronic kidney disease prevention. These evaluations offer a crucial opportunity to monitor your kidney health, identify risk factors, and detect early signs of kidney dysfunction. During these checkups, healthcare professionals assess your blood pressure, blood sugar levels, and conduct urine tests and blood tests to detect abnormalities like proteinuria. Early detection and intervention are vital in preventing CKD progression. If risk factors are identified, such as diabetes or hypertension, healthcare providers can work with you to manage these conditions effectively, reducing their impact on kidney health. Routine checkups also enable adjustments to medications or lifestyle changes as needed. Moreover, monitoring kidney function through estimated glomerular filtration rate assessments and serum creatinine levels helps in recognizing any decline in kidney function at an early stage. Addressing issues promptly and adopting preventive measures, the risk of CKD development or progression can be significantly reduced, ultimately safeguarding kidney health. CKD affects more than just the kidneys, leading to serious cardiovascular or heart complications, bone health issues, and affecting various other organs and systems. Managing CKD involves strict control of blood pressure, dietary management, and in advanced stages, dialysis or kidney transplant to address complications. Preventive measures for CKD include identifying risk factors like hypertension and diabetes, adopting a healthy lifestyle, and the importance of regular medical checkups for early detection. Early intervention and lifestyle changes are key to preventing CKD progression and maintaining overall health.